Wow. What is going on everybody? Yes, yes, yes. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. This is an Africa video, but I want to let you guys know something. Before we get into it, I want to say thank you so much to DraftKings for sponsoring this video, helping me financially by, by taking a very giant burden off my chest when it comes to like, Africa costs a ton of money to go there and come back and fish. Thank you so much to DraftKings. I want to tell you guys something. You guys know, football season is here. And with that being said, DraftKings is doing a $100,000 free to enter tournament this Sunday. I'm not kidding, free to enter this Sunday. Click on the link in the bio. If you think you are amazing at fantasy football and you want to enter one of these and you've never, I mean, if you've never done it, give it a shot. It's free to enter. Click the link in the bio. It'll take you to where you need to go. Download the app if you don't have it already. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? And remember, if you draft the perfect lineup, you can win $1 billion. Not kidding. Click the link in the bio, guys. Free this weekend. One week long, $100,000 freaking tournament. Got to do it. It's free to enter. If you haven't done it, see how good you are. Do it. Give it a shot. Now let's get into a little bit of Africa GT action. Hey, John. That looks a lot better. That looks tasty. Look at this. Oh yeah, there we go. This is gonna be nice. This thing is cooking though, there we go. Nothing like scrambled eggs in the morning. Actually, it's not really cooking yet. We just want that water to heat up so we can uh, forward into our little scrambled eggs. It's gonna be a great day. Today we're going after the GTs. The water is freaking phenomenal. I'm, I'm like super pumped right now. More so because the fire is just getting it. Oh yeah, it looks tasty. Scrambled eggs and bacon. confidence for today it's gonna happen I'm gonna catch my first GT and it's gonna be a giant absolute mondo sun's a little bright probably should put these on huh there you go that's clean that's how you put on your sunglasses I'm trying to see these whales it's gonna look real good through this nice oh, crusty glass oh there he is look at him look oh. at him look at him look at the whale he's right, he's there. right there look at him never would I have thought that that was gonna happen here well, the whale didn't want to come back up for you guys, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and flip on the. Flip on. Oh, he's over there. Oh, he's way over there, dude. Look at him. Oh, he's way. Oh my gosh, you see the tail of another one way over there. Lure of choice for the day is gonna be this sucker. Mine is uh, mine's got too small of a butt. No, what is it? Too too small of a mouth and too big of a butt. So he gave me one of his to use. That thing looks like a mondo. Whoo! Look at that. Whoo! Whoo! Ooh. GT action coming at you live. Well, not really live, but GT action coming at you soon, hopefully. That's that's crucial right there. That's what you guys want. That's what you want your, your bait to look like. Make sure to hook the back hook into the, the leader. It's perfect. Oh, I just hit myself right in the back. Right with a handle. Oh, oh my God. Did you see that? You? Yes. You know what's crazy about that? I was out in the middle of I was in the middle of popping the damn thing. <laughs> damn, it, dude. Hey, I just look at this. Look what happened here. Look, look at that. Look at that, John. Is that a G? Was that a GT? It was a Cuda. It was a Cuda. I'll take a Cuda. Let me get a Cuda. Anything big and voluptuous. Voluptuous. Big girthy son of a gun. My first strike of the day is an absolute miss. Didn't even feel anything. I was in the middle of popping it, dude. Just completely missed it. Dang it. Oh! Oh, I'm hooked up! I'm hooked up! You're on! You're on, baby! Oh, I'm hooked up! Holy! There we go! Oh, yeah! Oh. 
I see him. Watch out, Devin. Oh. Uh, come on, GT. Be a GT. Oh, I think it is. Uh. That's a GT. There we go, GT. Come on. Oh. Look at Strong that. son of a gun. Look at that. <laughs> come on. This is what I flew to Africa for right there. Oh yeah. That's Good. a baggie. <laughs> there we go. Ah, yay! Woo! <laughs> yes. Thank you, GT. <laughs> we recorded we good? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh. All the way to India to catch this GT. <laughs> I'm shaking, dude. Woo! How much oh, yeah. this thing weigh, you think? Uh, no, 35 pounder? You know what? I'll take it. Holy crap, that is awesome. These things fight insanely. Uh, it's so awesome. After three hours of throwing a popper. No, actually, I was throwing a stick bait. Three hours of stick bait action. Finally got me a GT. Oh, thank you. Oh my. Wow, he wanted to be back in the water. <laughs> ah, that was awesome, that was awesome. Well, after that glorious fight with that GT, I'm going to sit in the captain's chair. Well, actually, uh, this is not a captain's chair, it's a fighting chair, and just kind of, uh, I think we're gonna do a little bit of trolling action now. I think, uh, I don't know what the rules and regulations here are in Africa, but I don't think they're the same as the States. Well, they're, they're really stacking these rods up. He's got everything ready to go. So we got three, six, and then you got me just chilling. Just gonna sit here and wait, see, if it, see what happens. They said we could literally catch anything from tuna to wahoo to God knows what else. I haven't caught any of those yet, so I, I, I wouldn't mind linking up with one of those. Oh, son of a bitch! Oh. Oh. Whatever it is, I'm just gonna add another species to the list. Yeah. That'll be that'll be the goal. Cuda, y'all's version of a cuda. Oh, Narrow barred mackerel. Narrow barred mackerel. He's about to get the bong stick. All right. All right. Hey guys, I'm real glad I spent all the money on this bait. It actually worked. Change things up a bit. We're gonna be throwing a jig for a little bit. See if we can make them, see if we can get some stuff to eat this thing. Oh yeah, that sounds nice and tasty. Look at that, just drop down there. Oh, that one. Oh, yeah. Fish on. I love it. There we go. Oh, he's a big one. I don't think this is a GT. I'm just going to throw that out there. It doesn't fight nearly as much as a GT. Come on. Thank God we're in like 400 foot of water. Silver gills. Look. How silver the gills is. Wow. See that? Is that how it usually Oh, my it? God. Yeah, I've never seen that. Yeah. So what's going on in there? Oh, nothing. Just my swim bladder coming out. Okay, well, he's getting blood everywhere. You want to, you want me to put him in the box? Yeah. Silver gilled job fish. We're good to go. Wow. Yeah, it's quite a mess in there. Yeah, I might, I might save my, my body for another one. I'm being serious too when I say that. Saving myself for a, a GT. One thing you cannot say, whoa, we, we zoomed in here. Oh, we were way zoomed in. What is going on? One thing you cannot say on the water is that word that starts with an S, because right now, Peter, uh, that, Peter is, uh, he's, he's hooked up, but we're kind of worried he's gonna get taxed here in a second. Hopefully you got something giant on down there, Peter. Me and John are kind of just taking a, uh, a chill accent break. We've been trolling a little bit since we were doing that jig in action. John is meditating. We're getting, uh, we're kind of saving our, our muscles for the for more GT action here later on. We're waiting on the tide to go in. I don't know what happened. Did you get taxed or did he pop off? Uh, oh, uh, all that work. Uh, <laughs> all for retrieving a lure. <laughs> but you lose a big fish from now on and just imagine it. Uh, all you did was work your work your tail end off for retrieving a lure. <sighs> Back to cruising until the tide comes in. I'll, I'll, I'll give Africa this right now. Mozambique, your weather is it's perfect. We got 305. 
Jonah is hooked up on a fish. Come on, Jonah. Oh, geez, look at it. No. Sailfish! Whatever it is, it's running. Oh, screaming. All right, let's not get tacked, Jonah. Oh, it's, it's a marlin. Oh, my God, look at that. It is a marlin. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, look at that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, look at that. Oh my god, the marlin, you have a yellow for this kid taken by a marlin. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god. That was, so his bait just got eaten by the marlin. I mean, his fish got eaten by the marlin. He caught a yellow fin and then the yellow fin got eaten by a marlin and then the marlin spit the bait and everything came off. That was crazy. We, they were telling that the marlins are coming in here and they didn't know if they were in here yet. That's a pretty damn good indication that the marlins are here. That's awesome. What are the GTs? GT time. GT time. Oh! Oh, he's on, he's on, he's on, he's on! Oh. Blind, 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 blind. Looks like there's been a fire at the top. I know, look like, dude, I think it has caught on fire. You see that thing? <laughs> That's crazy. That boat for sure has caught on fire at some point in its life. Look at this. That thing is for sure has caught fire. <laughs> All right. I'll go ahead and walk, I'll see you later. Oh man. Well, it's dark in here. <laughs> what an incredible day that was. Now I'm kind of covered in, in salt. I feel like I need to uh, need off in the shower. Oh, that was awesome, was it not? I can't believe that John and I were able to come here on the first day and land a GT. I mean, I'm just going to say, we probably fished for them for about five to six hours. I would say five to six hours when we landed two. The other guy that was on the boat also had one come on, but he, he got off. I'm telling you guys, so these things are freaking hard to catch. Just imagine, I don't know if you guys have caught a jack of all. If a lot of you guys caught a jack of all, times ten. These things are the hardest fighting fish pound for pound in the, in the world. They're absurd. I'm talking like my groin area hurts so bad. From the rod, just I am. I basically impaled myself. I don't know if you guys know that. It hurt like, oh my god, that hurt. <sighs> but tomorrow, my goal is so today. I caught one on a stick bait. Tomorrow, my goal is to catch one on a popper. The one that we caught today was probably, they think, 35, 40 pounds. It seems pretty, pretty right to me. I don't know. You didn't weigh it. It was big. Yeah, I'll take it. But no, tomorrow, my, my goal is to catch one on a popper. And then we're going to start going after other fish. They got like ladyfish, kingfish. They named some fish that are a little bit different than ours, but I think they're the same thing. I don't really. I, and I think that's actually probably proper. It don't really matter. Anyway, thanks for watching. I love every single one of you guys for waiting this entire time to see these videos. I am pumped to be able to finally, 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 hey, good, good, no, finally pump some of these out. We got three more fishing days. Let's see what we can do. But you guys know the deal. If you guys have seen that video, click on that one right there. If you guys have already seen that one, then click on that one down there. And if you've already done that, then you need to subscribe down below. Other than that, thanks for hanging out with me, guys. I love every single one of you guys. And I'm about to disappear. <laughs>